Hey, how's everybody doing today? So today I'm gonna to show you how to add multiple languages on your keyboard for your iPhones, iPods, or iPads. Very simple to do, and it's cool because this way you'll be able to switch between different languages at will. Okay, so let's go into settings here. And then from settings, you wanna tap on general. And then from general, you wanna scroll down and you look for keyboard. Okay, so tap on keyboard. And then up here it says keyboards. Okay, so I'm gonna tap on keyboards there and you can see I have five different things going on here I have Chinese English Arabic French and emojis on here okay and if you wanted to uh, let me go ahead and delete some of these okay so I'm gonna go ahead and click on edit let me just show you how to delete real fast let's go ahead and delete French I'll get delete that click on done and now the French is gone let's go ahead and add another language on here okay so let me click on uh, add new keyboard and let's go ahead and add We'll just add Japanese here, okay? So tap on Japanese. We'll go with this one here, and I'll click on Done. Now you can see I have basically um, four things going on here, okay? So now I simply just open up or go to a keyboard. Let me just open up Safari just to go, go to a keyboard here. And now we can see this globe, um, this icon here. So if I press and hold this globe, it's going to give me an option of all those languages, okay? So if I want a Chinese, right there. If I press and hold, if I want to go into Arabic, right here, if I press and hold, I want to go back to English. There you go. So pretty simple. And also what you can do too, you can just tap the globe and it'll switch to your different language. So here's like uh, Chinese, here's Arabic, but it's if you have multiple languages, I think it's easier to just press and hold the globe and then select your actual, um, your language. And that's pretty much it. Any questions, just comment below. Thanks for watching.